OK, I've been waiting for this oh, moment. Uh, oh. Welcome back to the Sunday Footy Show. It is a special moment for any young man or young woman <laughs> who make their debut in the AFL. Now, at uh, Tullamarine this week, for example, we saw young Nick Bryan being told by the coach there he will be debuting today. So it was uh, a very, very special moment. You can see the relief on his face, the sheer joy as he sort of gets the handshake and off he goes. So, uh, look, I've got to say it's a, a little emotional for us <laughs> around here at the moment, but we had one of those similar occasions here at the Sunday Footy Show this morning. <laughs> so then items 118, 119, we just previewed today's games and then uh, we're out of here. So, hey guys, before we head down the studio, just, just one thing, uh, Kane. Obviously, uh, we took a risk on you when we picked you up at 107 in the mid-season media draft a few years back. But you've, you've impressed in the twos, uh, SEN, Trade Radio and the like. So, um, and we were really impressed with your performance last week with Eddie. So, well done, mate. As you know, Billy's unavailable for selection this week. So, uh, the list, it's all yours, mate. Well done. Thank you. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah. Yeah. So, good on you. Thanks, TJ. Hello. Hey, Dad. Uh, hello, my son. What's happening? Well, amazing news. Um, on the uh, Sunday footy show, TJ has given me Billy's list, so I'm taking over that today. So, it's huge news. Factor. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I've got, look, I've got to go chat to you. Oh, OK. See you, Dad. <laughs> yes, that's it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, so let's get into the list, and it's been dominated by the jumpers and the Collingwood jumpers. We're all sick of it, but we thought we'd go back in time and start with number five with the worst list of all time. We're getting it up here, Fremantle mods. Fremantle had some shockers, as have the West Coast Eagles with Glenn Jakovic and the boys, Andrew Embley. That was rubbish. Let's go to Geelong. Now, this rugby union style jumper is horrific. We hate it. Get rid of it, Brian Myers. Boys, thanks for your support. It's going beautifully, the list. Let's get into this one, number three. That's Peter Dean. That's Scott Camparelli. Carlton sold their jumper to M&Ms, if you don't mind. That was horrible. St Kilda did the same. And I think North Melbourne sold their orange jumper to a phone company. Peter Bill, big spider and the duck, Wayne Carey. Number two, oh, worst jumpers of all time. The biggest offenders have been Hawthorne. Oh, yeah, Johnny was, Platten oh, there okay, for no, the yeah, horrible yeah, yeah. jumper. And the Power Rangers with Jack Gunston yeah. and this horrific setup. But without doubt, the worst jumper in the AFL is this. It is oh. unimaginable. Oh. It is uninspiring. Oh. It is boring. <laughs> and quite frankly, it is a copy of this oh. magnificent prison bar oh, jumper. Yeah. So that is the worst jump in the AFL. Oh dear, Kane. That was, uh, <laughs> mate. That was great. Well done. Thanks, Steve. Can I just ask one question though? That that was very funny. Your little skit there with your dad. Uh, well, a little sad too. How many dads you got? <laughs> dad corns. Why'd you have dad corns on there? Oh, because I like it in order of alphabetical in my phone contacts. <laughs> so I like it to be. That's all, very weird. All in alphabetical order. So Chad's before dad. Yes. Yeah. Right. <laughs> what I a still strange don't quite get that. That's a strange thing to do. Because if you had it under Graham, it'd still be after Chad. So, <laughs> can I ask, where am I in your phone? Uh, under chumpers. Okay, <laughs> good, okay then.